Hi everyone, let's do a life cycle assessment of a sawmill. Let's create a new category under wood and name it sawmill. Let's create new process under sawmill. We'll get three products from this process. That is plank, sawdust and bark. These are the three significant products that we get. Planks would be around 500 kg. Then sawdust. Let's take it to be 400 kg. Then we'll get some bark. That's 100 kg. Of course, we also need to provide the allocation percentage for all these three products. 50%, so that must be 40 and 10%. And then uh, we also need to input the material and fuel that we've used. So let us combine two processes here. Let's select this and uh, let's select the already created process by us under wood, which is fell tree. Let's select it. Let's choose one ton. Yeah, and there are another set of inputs that we need to add. We'll have to transport it via road. So let us select transport, select. It will be around 250 kilometer and uh, then we need to input the electricity the energy electricity country mix high voltage here we can input the electricity according to the country that we are using the process in I'll choose India select it's around 150 kilowatt hour Okay, and uh, then there's emission to the air. We need to input all the emissions, harmful emissions that we are creating. Carbon dioxide. Which is around 450 kg. Then there is some carbon monoxide. Let us take it to be 2.9 kg. And there will be some nitrogen dioxide. This filter is very helpful. So let's select nitrogen dioxide. 500 gram. You should always check the units, it's really important. There will also be some particulates less than 10 micrometer. 40 grams again, units. Also, there will be some sulfur dioxide. These are the most important gases that are produced most harmful too. Brick grants. So yes, so we have all the inputs and outputs of our process here. This is the entire process. Let's save this data. So from under sawmill, we have the bark, planks, and sawdust. And so let us now choose planks and lice. 
if we calculate it without choosing the method we get the inventory we don't want that so let us now analyze it choose recipe midpoint h whole recipe calculate so this is the characterization graph of our process yellow shows transport blue shows the electricity contribution and uh, yeah, red shows contribution by the planks this is a normalization graph you can see that the most impact that this process has is on marine ecotoxicity then we have all the data you can either copy this data into excel sheet we have the characterization data if we exclude the long term uh, impacts the graph changes then yeah so we have the data again yeah so this was the slightly more complex life cycle assessment yeah you can copy this too Okay, thank you.